hey guys what's up we are going to continue with cyber panel and uh, we're gonna learn how to host a php script via cyber panel so let's get started before getting started let's uh, do it from scratch and we are going to create a new domain i mean in my case i'm going to create a subdomain let me give a folder name as php and uh, we are going to select a php version and add ssl and some uh, open base directory production we don't need dkim so by default we are attaching the php server to this folder or this public folder so let's wait for a few seconds and and wait for it to be created Da, 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 da. okay now it's actually created let's go pay a visit to that section we are going to list some domains and click on manage i'll click on file manager so if you see it over here there are a couple of files let me delete this one i'm not sure why this is not deleted okay uh, let this file be there and let us run the site php dot so if you see there's a by default there is some html file over there so let's test some php script over here here is a php echo hello world let's copy this and go back to your file manager and edit this file so save changes this is actually throwing some error because we need to make changes uh, there is this option i'm gonna give it as index.php so done let's refresh if you see it over here we have my first php and echo hello world let's go back and now try to run some script over this folder we are going to delete this file so we need, we should also create a database let's go back to the database section database where are you yeah it's over here we are going to we are going to go inside the php my admin because this is where uh, most of the database and uh, we need we are going to create a new database mm. so i have downloaded some script online music some i'm not sure what is that script about but that's a php code let's uh, extract this and get inside this folder and uh, there is a database section we need to import this file over here so the database name is dbmis dbmis oh that's a typo okay this is now created let's select the database and import some sql browse we are going to select this file i'm gonna click go uh nothing really is happening over here maybe because of some issue with this what is this let me zoom a bit and click on go 
is this actually working i think there should be some issue with this php my admin i can see a lag with this uh, this is strange let me refresh this actually there's nothing over here let us go back and uh, what's wrong with this button actually open uh watch or uh, interruption okay this is an sql mm. Mm. I think there should be some issue out here. I'm really not sure. So let's drag and drop this file. Okay, this says success. Okay, now the tables has been created. Let's get back and import some files. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to compress this folder and uh, upload this folder click on upload i think this is done now let me close this and uh, extract this okay done now this has been extracted let me delete this there you go confirm now we have a mis folder let's get back to the website let's refresh because there is no index php on a root file so we have to go through the url that is m m i s if you see this the script is actually running now let me get into the folder and check harry pass okay don't forget to create a database yeah it's all done let me log in j r r y E A S S. Not sure this this is going to work. Maybe there is some uh, issue with the script. Or maybe there is nothing out there in the admin page. So that's it, guys. That's it about this PHP script section. This is how you create a. I mean, host your PHP script in Cyber Panel. So done. Thank you all. Peace out.